maybe that first weird dream of yours was exactly six weeks ago, right? I think so, yes, but what's that got to do with anything? It just happens to coincide with Egyptian New Year. Oh, that's right. What a coincidence. Maybe. All I'm saying is let's be cautious. Anything ever happened to you, I would never forgive myself. <laughs> you and Alex are the only thing that matter to me. Well. Bembridge scholars have been begging me to run the British Museum. Those knickers are not mine. Jonathan. Hey, Alex, behave yourself for five minutes, all right? You betcha. Happy to be home. Couldn't be happier. It's the year of the scorpion. Me? Thought you might like that. So then I killed the mummy and all his minions and stole his scepter. Oh, you're so brave. <laughs> yeah. And rich. Did I mention rich? What do you think I'm doing here? <laughs> oh, sorry, we must be in the wrong house. I thought you said this was your house. No, I didn't. Call me. Uh -huh. You're not Sheila's husband, are you? No. Well, if you work for Johnny, I was going to pay him back on Tuesday. I don't know any Johnny. We're looking for the bracelet of Anubis. Oh, good. Good for you. Good thing to have the old bracelet of Anubis. Where is it? Ah, you're looking here for the uh, bracelet. I see what... Well, I have no idea what you're talking about. Mr. O'Connell, you try my patience. <laughs> Mr. O'Connell, no, wait, hold on a minute. You've got the wrong man. Ah, that bracelet. Yes, of course. Now I remember. I lost it in a card game. For your sake, I hope not. <laughs> it can't be. Hello. Hello. Where's your wife? My wife? Oh, you mean Evie. Uh, well, I think she went off to Baden-Baden or Tibet or something. The girl's a free spirit. Did I mention I was single now? Egyptian asps are quite poisonous. It's downstairs. There's a safe. The combination is, uh, uh, 320, 58, uh, 393 something. It's in the safe downstairs. I told you. I told you. And your point is? My point is I told you so you wouldn't kill me. When do we make that arrangement? Uh, are you... uh hello? <laughs> Uh, Jonathan, I thought I said no more wild parties. Oh, when you're popular. <laughs> Alex, I'm serious. If you've lost that key, you're grounded. I haven't lost it. I just can't find it. There's a difference. Well, you better start finding it, then. <laughs> I will, Mum. There's nothing to worry about. Good evening. Who are you? What are you doing here? I'm looking for the chest, of course. <laughs> Give it to me now. Get out of my house. Well, Mom, maybe not the best idea. Alex, get back there. Definitely not the best idea. 
think it's time to yell for Dad now. Now I would kill you and take it anyway. I think not. Ardeth, what are you doing here? Perhaps explanations are best kept for later. Ardeth Bay. Lochna? Okay, folks. Knowing my brother-in-law, he probably deserves whatever you're about to do to him. But this is my house. I have certain rules about snakes and dismemberment. <laughs> My friend, I'm not sure, but wherever this man is, your wife will surely be. Hey, I know him. He's a curator. He works at the British Museum. Are you sure? You better believe him. He spends more time there than he does at home. Okay, you're here. Bad guys are here. Evie's been kidnapped. Let me guess. Yes. They once again removed the creature from his grave. I don't mean to point fingers, but isn't it your job to make sure that doesn't happen? The woman who is with him, she knows things. Things that no living person could possibly know. She knew exactly where the creature was buried. We were hoping she would lead us to the bracelet. She obviously did. And now they have it. I wouldn't get too nervous just yet. Is that gold? When I stuck it on, I saw the pyramid of Giza. Then whoosh! Straight across the desert to Karnak. By putting this on, you have started a chain reaction that could bring about the next apocalypse. You, lighten up. You, big trouble. You, get in the car. Uh -huh. 